Hello everyone, this is Jay Dobbins on the Marvel DC Multiverse. We are now at episode 377, and I'll be discussing one topic, which is fans starting to boycott Black Panther 2 over demands of hashtag re recast the Chala. So, um... So yeah, they're doing it for one main reason. So, like when Marvel dropped the teaser of the uh, Black Panther sequel at San Diego Comic Con, um, again, you know, fans, you know, started talking. The trailer sparked a few queries surrounding the recasting of late actor Chadwick Boseman, who played the uh, lead role of T'Challa slash Black Panther. So, um, with the trailer showing no remnants. Uh, a possible recast uh, esque persona to fill the heroic void fans sounded off on Twitter. No matter what Chadwick, no matter what Chadwick will always have a place in our hearts. One fan um, tweeted, "He's our Black Panther, but the show must go on. It's not about dignity or disrespecting the character." Uh, Bozeman would have wanted. Hashtag recast child to pass the beacon rather than killing the character with all of uh with all of this honor and uh morals. End quote. So um also another um highlight another fan highlighted a news article where Bozeman's own brother acknowledged that the late actor would have wanted uh, the Chala recast to continue the film's legacy. Um, what was it called? Uh, one point, um, yeah, that's right. So another fan, and the fan said, and I quoted, as Bozeman's family members have publicly stated in agreement with hashtag recast of Chala, keeping uh, 616 T'Challa, Alive, Honors Chadwick, they wrote. Sorry, end quote. So last December, uh, Marvel boss Kevin Feige explained why he would not recast T'Challa in honor of uh, Bozeman and would instead focus on uh, the sequel on the other Wakanda characters introduced in the first film. Deadline reports. Um, Kevin Feige said, and I quote, I wanted to acknowledge the devastating loss of a dear friend and member of the Marvel Studios family. End quote. So he said that during a day, during a, during a Marvel presentation at Disney Investor Day. So, and he also said, and I quote, that Terry Bozeman was essentially, was an essentially, sorry, an immensely talented actor and an inspirational individual who affected all of us, all of our lives personally and professionally. His portrayal of T'Challa, the Black Panther, is iconic and transcends iteration of the character in uh, any other medium from Marvel's past. End quote. Feige, after Feige confirmed the T'Challa, sorry, the T'Challa wouldn't be recast, fans created a hashtag recast T'Challa petition. That has got you know that has garnered over sixty thousand signatures from fans, including myself. I I also signed a petition. So, but yeah, so from fans who wanted to see uh, the child's betrayal continue. So, are they gonna do it? I don't know. Depends on how much backlash they get. So, we'll uh, see. But right now, as long as Black Pan as long as he, as long as Marvel Studios talks about Black Panther, will kind of forever. T'Challa will recast T'Challa will trend. They do another trailer, recast T'Challa will trend, just like it did in the teaser. And when they when they released the teaser on at San Diego Comic Con, they recast T'Challa immediately started trending. So. It's going to continue, and they're not going to stop until they either recast the character or get in a, a put it in the T'Challa variant. Either way, it's a win-win. So, 
That concludes this uh, topic. Feel free to visit us and like us on Facebook. We are available on iTunes, Google Play Music App, Spotify, and of course, YouTube.